I've been sitting on the the, ba- the bow of the boat, enjoying the movement of the boat in the water for the past 10 minutes. It's been really nice. I think this is the longest I've been alone in three weeks. It's crazy. <laughs> it's a nice, uh, peaceful end to a day that started pretty dramatically. We woke up to the boat heeling over in the water, mast apparently once dipped in the water. Um, leftover pie from dinner in one of the berths. <laughs> books flown all over the place and with winds of uh, between 30 and 50 which when was predicted maybe 10 15 knots um, and a sail that was far too big and was getting beaten up quite badly so we had to rush to take that down um, and that was about 5 a.m we did an inspection in the light to check that everything was okay and everything seems good so it's all fine <laughs> that's a nice end to a nice peaceful end to the day so John's decided to impress the um, to impress in his Italian cooking. <laughs> we do this regularly on this boat. We have we go to different countries, and I usually take you to different countries via the food. And tonight we're having Italian. We've had lots of Erin has been taking us to all over the world with her cooking, <laughs> and she's cooked the whole way. And it's about time she had a night off. Bless her, she has cooked nearly every meal, and I can't thank her enough. So, I'm cooking tonight. It'd probably be crap, but you know. <laughs> what do you want about? That looks great. So, this is the pizza base just uh, whizzing up. And then we've got. Everybody uh, knows this is how you do pizza bases. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Everybody knows this. And uh, anybody who doesn't know it doesn't know about pizza bases. And then we've got olives and sweet corn, and we've got tomato to go on top, and cheese, and oh, all sorts of stuff. It's fantastic. That sounds great. I'm excited to see what it'll be like. Where is it? Let's have a look, Aaron. What's it look like? That's pretty good. You're whacking into it. Mm. It's nearly finished. Is it? How does it taste? Amazing. It's great. I love it. So we're having pizza on Netflix. <laughs> <laughs> well, here we are. We've dropped the sails and we're just uh, motoring into Guadeloupe. And on the beach here are our first palm trees. We're really in the Caribbean. Wow. Over 3,000 miles. What do you reckon, Aaron? I think the wide smile says it all. Uh, what's happening here, John? Um, well, just making dinner. And, uh, yeah, amazing. I'm making dinner. And everything is still. It's motionless. It's crazy. Look at this. The boat just stays still. Where have we come from and where are we going now? Oh, well, um, we've come from uh, Las Palmas in the Canary Islands. And we are in Guadeloupe. <laughs> over 3,000 miles away. And... It is mill pond calm. I mean, there, there is not a ripple on the water. It's glass. I don't think you'll be able to see it in the dark. No, well, kind of. Yeah, yeah. But it is incredible. And the boat is motionless, which it's is amazing. What's your first fav- for three weeks. What's your favourite part about being on land or at anchor? <laughs> um, oh, on land, um, we've had ice cream. We went ashore and we had ice cream. That was pretty good. That was pretty cool. <laughs> and um, so now I'm making pizza now. Um, by popular request. Yes, it's back again. Yes. And it's just, it's been an awesome day. I mean, we arrived in uh, in Guadeloupe, which is in the Caribbean, and we arrived here first thing this morning. We had to sort of pause, we had to heave to um, just off the island, because we were a little early, it was still dark, but only for half an hour. And, uh, and then the, the dawn came up, and we pedalled our way in, and we're in a little anchorage. Yeah, it's, it went pretty smoothly. It did, didn't it? That's pretty good. It was a really good entry. It was great. We piloted our way in, and uh, yeah, here we are. We've been ashore. Um, as I said earlier, we've had ice cream, and we've had sh- a shower. Fresh water. Can you showers. smell the cleanliness coming through the camera? Oh yeah, <laughs> smell that clean. It's really cool. So, um, so we're all feeling pretty elated uh, to be on land. Yeah. And we're now getting our legs, our land legs, back. <laughs> uh, very drunk and walking when we first arrived. Yeah. Check in. So, we had, um, when we checked in, in at Cadiz, the, the um, port police, the, the border control, they were so nice and, and they glanced briefly at our passports and then spent an hour and a half talking about the boat and what we were doing and our projects and everything. And then when we, when we checked into uh, Las Palmas, into, into the Canaries, we, um, we had to go and see the, the police and uh, the normal thing is you all queue up outside and 
you go in with your passports and they interrogate you and um, and they come on board your boat and do everything. Well, the, the the day we went there, it was the chief of police was doing it. It's normally one of his minions, but it was the chief of police there. And uh, instead of the sort of 10 minute checking which everybody was doing in this queue, he spent 45 minutes talking to us. And unfortunately, most of the people behind us, they had to come back the next day because they only do it for a limited time. <laughs> And he was just couldn't stop talking. He was really interested in the project, and he fo he's followed us on YouTube and Instagram. The chief of police, how cool is that? And then we went to check in today, and we wandered into the marina, and they have a, a terminal, and you just check in at the terminal. It's so easy. It was brilliant. So all our border things have been, yeah, great so far. So we've got a lucky charm. I know. <laughs> yes, we have our lucky charm, Erin, and um, and. So uh, there are several things I have to say about the trip. Uh, one of the reasons that I'm cooking this evening is a very important reason is because pretty much every evening meal on the trip was cooked by Erin. Breakfast was cooked by Erin. Lunch was cooked by Erin. <laughs> cooked all the meals, bless her cotton socks. And we were rolling, we were leaping about, the boat was going fast, or, and it was just, it was not easy. And I'm going on strike. <laughs> yeah, bracing her, she, she deserves a rest. And, uh, yeah, she, she's been a hero, so we're, we're pretty chuffed with No, we're exceptionally chuffed with her. <laughs> Trying to brace yourself in our galley is not easy uh, when the boat's rolling and um, roaring along. And uh, she produced fantastic meals. So after three weeks at sea, and washing our clothes in salt water, it's so nice to get them washed in fresh water. But the whole boat has laundry around it. <laughs> but it's cool. Everything's smelling nice. It's going to be just so nice.